Good day my friend, in this occasion I would like to demonstrate how to use an app, it's called KeyPass Droid to manage all your password and account of course. So as long as you um, work on internet, you will have a lot of account and also with different password to make it secure. So um, um, to manage all of that and to make you easy to log on to your various and numerous account and password you have to of course have uh, a, a, a manager to manage all of that so that when whenever you want to log on for your gmail i don't know yahoo or and then facebook you can easily remember all the account and uh, and specific password for that so if you do not manage that you will um feel uh confuse which one is your account and which one is the password so uh, i uh, will demonstrate to you one uh popular uh password manager it is called key pass droid as you can observe on my screen so uh, before i uh you have this uh, apps of course you have to go to google play first and then just uh, type the name as you observe on my screen just uh key pass draw it and then you will have you will hit enter and you will have the icon and please click uh, on the uh, uh, icon and you it will automatically install on your on your phone so when you have installed you will have the icon just like me here on my screen and then to begin this i will now uh, click the icon so you just need to click the icon and you will, you will have the first screen so the first screen will be this screen so this screen uh, uh it is it has a lot of uh uh word here so it's it's uh, called key pass the read and you have donate about and three dots on the uh, top right and also you have this file st uh, storage emu um, emulated you don't have to change anything you just go to need if you first um um uh, uh open this key pass through it you will need to uh, hit create and it will uh, bring you to a new page uh, for uh, uh, typing your main password it, main password mean that uh, the you you your password when you log in to keep pass through it uh, it means that that the password should be this the the best one why because when uh, when people can uh, guess your key pass it password it will uh, it will bring them inside th this this apps and they will uh, see all your password inside this so you have to uh, pay attention to the this main password and then while you have your main password you just need to create uh, here underneath uh, hit the button create and it will uh, give you uh, uh, if you if you uh, it will lock you into the key password but in this case i have a uh, create one so i cannot uh, click create again so i know i i will go to underneath and type my password my main password for this key password so i click open now and it will bring me this uh, page key pass through it uh, my, my password it asks me my main password so I will, I will stop the video in a minute uh, to type my password so now I have my password there what I need to go is just click OK and then underneath you don't have to write anything to that uh, key file because it does it optional so I just need to click OK now and it say working and then i have a lot of uh account inside it i have home banking account and also recycle bin if you delete any account it will direct you to recycle bin i have this account this uh uh, email, uh yahoo account and two gmail account uh, now i will demonstrate how to make uh uh, this uh, account list here uh, account list and also your password for example if you if i show i can show you how how my yahoo account here if i click here on my the email you will have a list of my uh the first i have a uh, name of the of the uh, account and username for that account 
and then also the url mail.yahoo and then my password uh, comment and then need comment and uh, the date of created and modification and access how many access and ex expired i say never so you can also edit if you want to add anything here but now i will demonstrate how to create something like this uh, for you in this case i want to uh, create now my facebook account so uh, i just need to come back here to this main home and uh, now underneath you have to two item there add entry and add group if you click add group you will have something like uh if you click here underneath add group you will have something like this so you will have a uh, home banking for example you have a lot of banking account you will have this group home banking so uh, a lot of your banks uh username and password will be inside there and maybe i can create one more uh uh add uh, group for this all my email will be inside that group and uh, for now i will click add entry so i will have list here one more list here for my facebook so to do that i just need to click add entry so here add entry i will click that and boom i will have something like this for so for first of all for the name i will type face book and my username it should be that for my facebook as long as I remember this is my username okay now uh, url for facebook as you understand it should be www dot oh my mistake face book dot com and now i will type my password but i will stop uh, post a video in a minute so uh, it's safe for me and also for you okay now so you have password and also the confirm password and the last box here you have comment you don't have to create anything now you will you have two options underneath save or cancel in this case i am satisfied with the this all of the submission so i will click save now and then i will have one facebook underneath over here if you pay attention now i have my one more list of my username and password for facebook so how does it work now now i will open my facebook and log log in using this key password so for example i have my facebook over here so uh, i have to type my email and password so instead of i typing uh manually i uh, i will go to my uh keep password first and then open this click on this facebook list and then i have a lot of here it, it says select to copy username to clipboard on the top of the screen if you can see but um in this case i want to click these three dots on the uh, right top corner if you can see that three dots uh here if you click on that you will have a lot of option so go to url which is we have go uh, for facebook.com you have go just now and then copy user and copy password i want to cl uh, click on copy user now okay now my username which is the email at yahoo.com will be copy on my um clipboard and when i go to my facebook now i just need to click and then paste done my name the email is there now and now for my facebook i will do the same uh thing also go to my key password hit this three dots on the top uh right corner and copy password the password is now copied to my clipboard and i go back to my facebook and then click on password and then hit paste and then when i have my username and account of course now i can log in to my facebook i will click login now and then i will have uh, wait to a minute and then i will have my facebook over here okay uh i can uh uh do the same activity like just like that for my other account also for example if i have a lot of 
uh, if you see to my key pass Dravid, I have also a lot of uh, email there I can do this just the same uh, for my email for example if I want to access my uh, Yahoo mail here I have my Yahoo here but if I want to add another mailbox for example So Yahoo now I, I just need to type the the uh, username there just need to go to here for example this I will click this the email and I have a, a username and also password let's go there and copy user go back to this and click add paste and next next now i need to type my password and go back to my key pass it and hit this three dot copy password and go back to my yahoo mail let's come back i don't know somehow they come back but I should type it manually as for for this one. I'll stop in a minute now. Now my password. I click sign in now. It's login. Okay, now I have my uh inbox for my uh Yahoo over here. So that is really useful uh, to manage all our password here. You can always add any uh, username and password you have here, and also you can easily remember them. Of uh, otherwise, you if you don't remember, you just need to click to that uh, specific name and go to that three dots. It will automatically copy to your clipboard. And don't um, don't worry if 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 the password keep in your keyboard because when um, when you lock off of this key pass draw it the the clip the clipboard will be uh delete um so not not user not any username and password will be left in your uh in your uh, uh, specific uh, in your clipboard so you can also manage of this uh, password for, for example you can you want to go to setting go ahead and uh, application setting if you want to uh, clear recent history file go ahead and then uh, if you click this uncheck uh, and your history file uh, will be uh, erase all and also uh, mask password if you want go ahead and click and also you have a lot of other option here which is I don't need to um, explain to you one by one because this is very basic uh, uh, setting and also if you come back uh, again you will have this setting here uh, for for I think the same application also uh, you have clipboard time out for example uh, uh, this uh, this uh, the clipboard will be delayed until in five minutes only so after in uh, the six minutes all your clipboard will be clean so uh, no worry about um, about uh the password and the username that you have copied to your clipboard because this specific application will erase it and, and uh, uh, uh six minutes after you you del uh, you have it so guys that's it uh from me today uh i really commend you to download this key password and manage all your password and username uh, because this is very useful and save a lot of time so Thank you for watching. Bye for now.